Adam, it's David. You in the building? Just entered the lobby. Sorry to pull you out of sick leave so soon, but uh, we've got a situation. A breaking out of Milwaukee Junction factory. Meet me at the helipad. I have to see Pritchard first. Something's wrong with my retinal enhancement. Frank's on the second floor in the tech lab. Make it quick. People's lives are at stake. massacre wasn't his fault. Then why was he kicked off the force? I'm just saying he's too much of a risk. Jensen, uh, didn't hear you coming. You should probably be heading for the helipad, don't you think? Care to repeat what you were saying about me to my face, Peterson? Hey, hey, listen. I didn't mean anything by it. <laughs> I'm just tense about the Milwaukee Junction situation. Everybody is. And you think telling people that their chief of security isn't up to the job is a good way to make them feel better? No, no, that's... that's not what I... Look, Jensen, everybody here knows what happened to you six months ago. Normal people don't recover from augmentation surgery this fast. I guess I'm not normal, then. Apparently not. Glad we could clear that up. Oh, and for the record, I wasn't kicked off the force. I quit. That's not what the papers said. The papers lie. You had your say, and I learned my lesson, all right? Ah, uh, uh, well, um, welcome back, Mr. Jensen. The new look suits you. Good luck tonight. Why is David keeping the SWAT team from going in right away? Doesn't he remember the last attack? You can't compare the two. Those guys were obviously military. These ones are just vandals. Vandals with guns and bullets that kill people. Look, David cares about his people, but he needs to protect his client's interests. Don't worry, I'm sure he's got a plan. About time, what happened? You get stuck in an air duct on the way over? Yeah, nice to see you too, Francis. Something's wrong with my retinal display. Can you fix it? If it's what I think it is, probably. Of course, it might be. Oh, looks like your left and right imaging processors weren't completely in sync. But don't worry, your sentinel health implant will kick in soon, repairing any damage that might have caused. Your retinal display should be fine now. Its recognition software won't be picking up hostiles yet, but you should be seeing radar and targeting reticules. Biomedical data, too, if you're in pain. Right. We done here? Because Saraf is waiting for me at the helipad. I know. Radicals have broken into our manufacturing plant and taken hostages. Maybe this time you'll actually save people. If you got a problem with me, Pritchard, why don't you just say it and get it over with? Why no, Jensen? I don't have a problem with you. If anything, I blame myself. The mighty Pritchard blaming himself. <laughs> That's gotta be a first. I'm the one who told Sarif we needed a physical security team to protect us. If he'd read my report closely enough. Wait a second. Are you saying it was your idea to hire me? Not you, Jensen. I wanted Dynacore, Sharp Edge, or Bell Tower. All the top private security contractors were on my list, but Sarif wanted somebody in-house. And so did Dr. Reed. I suggest you leave Megan out of this. Why, Jensen? It's no secret how close the two of you were. And let's face it, you'd just been fired from SWAT for that massacre in Mexican town. No one was about to hire you. You really have to stop getting your news from those Pikus blogs, Francis. They only confuse you. The point is, if Sarif had listened to me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But Megan, God love her, always did have Sarif's ear. Seraph's here is going to be hearing a report about violence in the workplace if you keep this up. You really feel like continuing? Point taken. Well, 
look at this. Finally decided to get off your ass, Adam. Glad to see it. For a while there, I thought you'd never walk again. Adam, how close are you to the helipad? Almost there. Good. Because SWAT's about to turn this into a PR nightmare. Meet me in the chopper. I'll brief you as we go. Welcome back, Jensen. Didn't think we'd see you around here for a while yet. You know how it goes, Malik. Duty calls. Don't I know it. I was in my wingsuit halfway to the top of the Renaissance Center when I got the 911. But you? Six months is a hell of a short time to come back from the dead. You sure you're ready for this? Only one way to find out. Roger that. The boss is already on board, arguing with the DPD's tactical response team. They've got the plant surrounded, but Mr. Seraph wants you to go in first. Are you all set here? Because the sooner we take off, the better it will be for everyone. I'm ready. Great. Then let's get airborne. I told Farida to put us down on a roof. I don't want the crowd seeing you go in. Fine. As long as she pulls you out the minute I'm gone. So what am I looking at here? Who are these guys? Pro-human purists, or so they say. The same purists who've been firebombing limb clinics all over the country. You buy that? Nah, I don't think it's a coincidence they hit us today, only hours after we moved the Typhoon in for assembly line factory. The Typhoon? Megan's team was testing it the day that bastard... Who's on point for these guys? Adam. I know you and Megan were once... Who is on point for these guys? Goes by the name of Sanders. That's him, there. He's an augmented Adam. So he can't be one of the mercs who attacked us. But he did know exactly how to get inside our plant. Alright. So how do you want me to handle this? First priority is the Typhoon. I'm keeping SWAT out until you've secured it. As far as rules of engagement go, I'll defer to you. Lethal or non-lethal? I'm not looking to start a firefight in there, just neutralize them. Okay, but just make sure those bastards don't wake up and warn their friends. You remember what it's like in there? A lot of tight enclosed hallways, but the labs themselves are pretty open. High ceilings. So. Do you want something you can use from a distance, or up close? Give me something with distance. If I get too close, I'll take them out personally. Just try not to break anything expensive. The Typhoon should be in the factoring labs, but Pritchard will tell you more as you go in. I've got him running comms. Terrific. Anything else? Keep your eyes open for hostages. Free them if you can, but the Typhoon is your number one priority. We developed it for the Alphabet agencies, and if we don't deliver it to them intact and still a secret, well, I'm sure you'll get the job done right. Gentlemen, prepare for landing.
had a beat on one of the alleys for a while. Didn't want to risk alerting his friends, though. Good luck. Well, look at this. They're sending in a can opener to do a man's job. Those purity first assholes are just gonna love this. You don't have time to sit around jawing, buddy. Get in there. Tell me you're the guy we've been twiddling our thumbs waiting for. SI Security. Name's Jensen. Jensen? Yeah. I thought I recognized you. Used to be on Team 2 till that Mexican town thing went down. I gotta say, you're the last person I pictured taking orders from a CEO. Things change. Not always for the better. Feel like getting in there and doing whatever it is your boss wants you to do? Because maybe then we can do our job. Intel on these purists. How much you got? How much you want. They communicate any demands yet? Not yet, but I get the feeling they're not that organized. Most of the guys I've seen look like street bangers and thugs. The kind who get their jollies trashing equipment. You ask me, is the man in charge you have to worry about? How many am I looking at down there? Hard to say. We've spotted three in the courtyard, maybe half a dozen inside. But that's a sketchy estimate at best, since we seem to be getting a loop playback off your intellicams. That shouldn't be possible. I told Seraph to make sure Pritchard overhauled the system. Well, someone inside must be tech savvy, because all we're seeing is a loop. For all we know, there could be five, ten, or three dozen perps in there. The leader's name is Sanders, right? What's his story? Zeke Sanders. We're running background on him now. Looks like he fought two tours in the Gulf. One of them on a recycled military bill. You mean he's augmented? Seraph told me he's not. He used to be augmented. Says his augs made him do evil shit, so he ripped him out. Now he's got a whole crew of gullible street kids listening to his crap and ready to die for him. Or kill. I think I've heard enough. You sure? Wouldn't want to make your boss unhappy. You look pretty dug in up here. What's the React team plan? We got Alpha as Point and Bravo as Wing, both standing by to breach the target. We're coordinating from here, but until your boss gives us the go-ahead, we're just holding our dicks. Realistically, how much time do I have before any shooting starts? According to protocol, none. According to your lawyers? The sooner you get in there, the sooner we can hose this powder keg down and call it a day. We've got people inside. Any idea where I should look for them? Yeah. Your plant manager, Josie Thorpe, managed to slip a call out before someone snatched her cell. She said the hostages are being held in an office near the assembly labs. Makes sense. The workers were setting up for a production run, so they'd have been concentrated there. You know more about that than I would. Anything else? I got it from here. Sit tight. Wait for Seraph's signal. Like we got a choice. You forget something, Jensen? We've got people inside. Any idea where I should look for them? Yeah. Your plant manager, Josie Thorpe, managed to slip a call out before someone snatched her cell. She said the hostages are being held in an office near the assembly labs. Makes sense. The workers were setting up for a production run, so they'd have been co You know more- I got it from here. Like we- About fucking time. You know there are hostages in there, right? Maybe you should talk to your boss about his goddamn priorities. He's put them in danger, delaying us like this. About time you got here. This tour will take you to another roof overlooking the loading docks. Best way in. Now hurry! Yeah, yeah. No time to chat. We've been waiting too long already. Jensen, it's me, Pritchard. Where are you? On a roof overlooking the plant. Good. Your point of entry should be through shipping and receiving. Should be, Francis. What the hell does that mean? We have an employee entrance there. Heavily guarded by purists, no doubt. So, if you're not a fan of the frontal assault, I suppose you could try accessing the building's roof. Yeah, everything seems under control. No sign of SWAT. No sign of anyone.
Nicely done, Jensen. Pritchard, I'm in. Nicely done, Jensen. May I ask how? A vent on the roof. It'll be in my report next time we discuss security loopholes. Oh, goody. I'll be sure to take notes. The Typhoon is in the factoring labs. There's an elevator just past the assembly labs that will take you to it. Got it. I hope six seven.
Jensen, I just tried to unlock the assembly lab door, but my override codes aren't working. Someone's changed the protocols. What? Didn't you plug the... I'm on it. But until I find this particular breach and fix it, you'll have to hack the door manually. Pritchard out. Access granted. This guy won't be the last skinner in here who buys it. Shut up, J-Ro. Trevor, you gotta calm down. Help me find something to cover him up with. I'm telling you, man, these hands of lovers deserve what's coming to them. Squad. Hurry! I don't want to die. Where's the bomb squad? Save us! Hurry! Do something! I don't want to die. Do something! Oh, Access me. granted. Automated dispersal device deactivated. Countdown terminated. Have a nice day. Pritchard, get word to Seraph. I found the hostages. I'm relaying good news, I hope. They're safe, and they're staying put. SWAT will have to expel them as soon as I've got the prototype. I'll tell Seraph, but don't take too long. Listen up. I need you all to stay calm, keep your voices down, and wait here for SWAT. The plant's not clear yet. Not clear? But those terrorists, they've got my wife! Your wife? She's the manager here. Josie, Josie Thorpe. They said they needed her to open the administration building. They were looking for evidence of some kind. Please, I haven't seen her since. You have to find her. I'll do my best. But right now, I need you all to stay here and wait for the police. Can you do that? Yes, of course. But please, hurry. You said they were looking for evidence? What kind of evidence? I... I don't know. They're purists. They think the body is sacred and shouldn't be tampered with. They probably want something that will implicate us in moral wrongdoings. Did they know about the typhoon? It's a top secret contract. How could they? And we only moved it in a few hours ago. Please, I don't think they expected anyone would be working today. And now that they're backed into a corner, you have to find my wife, please. Thank you. 
Europe in the plan. Factory workers have been taken hostage and the top Back now to that breaking news coming out of Detroit. Police are still not saying much about the situation, but sources tell me that a militant group of pro-human activists have raided a Seraph Industries plant. Factory workers have been taken hostage, and the entire city holds its collective breath. I doubt I need to remind you folks that this is the second time the biotechnology firm has been attacked. The first time, six months ago, on the eve of controversial hearings set to scrutinize the company's research. With those hearings permanently on hold, many are now wondering if something else may be going on. Is David Seraph hiding something? For tonight, this is Eliza Kassan reporting to you live from Pike. Back now to that great... Access granted.
Step away from the console. Now! Richard, you still there? Where else would I be? Patch me to Seraph, now. Adam, it's David. You got the Typhoon? Yeah, but you were right about there being something more behind this. Because I've also got a dead purist in here with some pretty interesting cerebral implants. Don't touch them. We'll need an expert to recover his neural hub, in case it's booby-trapped. Copy that. What about Sanders? SWAT's pre- Pressure me to let them off the leash. Find them before they do, and deal with them. saying much about the situation, but sources tell me that a militant group of pro-human activists have raided a Seraph Industries plant. Factory workers have been taken hostage, and the entire city holds its collective breath. I doubt I need to remind you folks that this is the second time the biotechnology firm has been attacked. The first time, six months ago, on the eve of controversial hearings set to scrutinize the company's research. With those hearings permanently on hold, many are now things, seeing things, man, I gotta lay off the hard stuff. Thank you. 
Access granted. 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 
Access granted. Access granted. Access granted. Lie to me. I don't want to hurt you. You're a civilian. But I will if you don't give me a choice. If you didn't want to hurt anyone, you should have stayed home tonight. Oh, look! Seraph's attack dog! You're here to clean up before the police bust in? He thinks we're breaking the law. Shut up! All you body polluters break laws. You're all the same. You're going to have a hard time convincing people you're any different once they hear you had an AUG on your team. What? I found your attack dog in the factoring labs, trying to cut through security with his implanted hackware. Nice try, Cholo. But I would never let one of you freaks on my crew. Ah! Back off, Hunter. I got business to take care of, understand? If what you say is true, and I'm not saying it is, you hear? But I gotta... I gotta check things out. So me and la vieja, we're leaving. Chance this ends now. Her blood. Are you still there? Adam! Adam, what's happening? What's your situation? Adam! Sanders is down for the count. SWAT will want to question him, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't know a thing. Somebody else set this up. Damn it. Okay, I want you back here now. The admin building has a rooftop terrace. Meet Farida on it. Copy. Jensen out. Are you alright? I'm fine. I'm fine. Just a little shaken up, but what about the other hostages? My husband was with them in one of the assembly labs, and I overheard talk about a bomb. Don't worry, they're safe. Oh, thank God. When those men surprised us. Mr. Jensen, they should not have been able to get in. With the typhoon being moved in and all, I double-checked the protocols myself. Yeah, I expect Pritchard's doing the same thing right now. Stay here. DPD will want to question you. But you and your husband should be reunited soon. Thank you, Mr. Jensen. You're a hero.
Access granted. Catching the leader, Jensen. Maybe we can get some information out of him. I know you were probably tempted to finish him right there, considering what he thinks of enhancers. But you did the right thing. Sorry, Mr. Thorpe. But the target is on lockdown. I can't let anyone in. But my wife, she's still in there. I, I, I need to know that she's okay. You'll have to wait until the building is secure. Now back up and let the SWAT team do their job, please. My wife. Is she all right? She's fine. A little shaken up, though. Swab will need to debrief her. We'll see her soon. I, I don't know what to say. I, I, I think I've given up on her. You're a true hero, man. I'll find some way to repay this, I swear. There's no need for that. I was just doing my job. Don't be modest. I, I didn't recognize you before, but I know who you are, Mr. Jensen. And I know you weren't supposed to be back at work yet. Thank God you are. I'll be in touch. Count on it. I gotta admit, Jensen, I'm glad someone decided to send you in first. No telling what would have happened if one of us ran into that hostage room. Not sure we could have defused that bomb in time. Nice going. Nice job securing the plant. I wouldn't have thought a security guard could handle this. Not even an augmented one. I was ready to come in here with a bucket and a mop. Glad to see I was wrong. You're the one Serif called in to handle this, right? You caught the guy who led these radicals. Might have been better if he hadn't made it, though. You know what I mean? He'll just keep spreading his anti-augmentation poison. Seriously. I can't thank you enough. You made a lot of people happy tonight, Jensen. And not just the men in suits. It's what they pay me for. No. They pay you to put corporate interests ahead of people. You found a way to satisfy everyone. Guess Dr. Reed was telling the truth about you. Megan? What are you talking about, Malik? Before you were hired. She said the papers were lying about Mexican Town. That you weren't fired from the force. You quit when you realized protect and serve had become protect and serve the corporate interest. Nice to see she was right. You ready to go? Not quite yet, Malik. Can you wait here? Yeah, but don't take too long. Boss is expecting you. Sorry, Mr. Thorpe, but the target is on lockdown. I can't let anyone in. But my wife... Nice job securing the plant. I wouldn't have thought a security guard could handle this. Not even an augmented one. I was ready to come in here with a bucket and a mop. Glad to see you. Sir, if you could back away, please. Let us mop up around here. We'll be out of your facility as soon as we're done. Jensen! So, you're the one David Sarah sent in, huh? At least you left some of the bastards for us to deal with. Don't know how you got through all those guys without them noticing you, though. This is an act of crime scene. Please don't touch anything.
would have liked to find a few more of these assholes shot full of holes. Purity first. What a joke, am I right? Please, sir, the situation is under control. There's no reason for you to be hanging around here. The situation is under control. You're a Sarah security agent, aren't you? I gotta say, I expected a lot more resistance when we stormed the buildings. Wasn't a whole lot of fight left in these guys, though. Any idea how they all got knocked out? This is an active crime scene. Please don't touch anything. You've already got enough heavy lifting. Listen, pal, I got a job to do. I don't have time to answer your questions. Access granted. Sir, if you could back away, please. Let us mop up around here. So, you're the reason we were kept out of here. Great. Hope all your little secrets are locked away good and tight. Lucky for you, the Sarge won't let us near those Pikas reporters outside. Someone might let the truth slip out for a change. Listen, pal, I got a job to do. I don't have time to answer. trying to prove? Did they honestly think that they'd get the public behind them by taking hostages? Crazy bastards. The whole lot of them. Sir, if you could back away, please. Let us mop up room. I gotta admit, Jensen, I'm glad someone decided to send you in first. No telling what would have happened if one of us ran into that hostage room. Not sure we could have defused that bomb in time. Jensen? You're the guy who was sent in before us? Those hostages owe you a lot. Nice going. Defusing that bomb was some quick work. Please, sir, the situation is under control.
are you still doing here? The press want you to take over the investigation too? Why don't you get in your little private chopper and let us do our job? What's left of it? Specialist, aren't you? The one Seraph brought in. Well, you did your job. Whatever you needed to hide is probably hidden, so now you can stay out of our way. Please, sir, the situation is under control. You're SI security, right? Can you tell me what the hell you guys are hiding in here? We were sitting on our asses a long time before we got the go-ahead to come in. Look, no offense. I know you work for this company, but I, I don't like people pulling the department's strings. I don't care how much money your boss has, or what he's done for the city. Now he's got me wondering what he's hiding. Goddamn. Why the hell were we held back? It just gave them a chance to prepare. Uh, maybe next time. Why not send them a written warning? Dear terrorists, we will be storming the facility at 9 p.m. sharp. Please be ready. Fuck. I know you work for this company. Poor stupid bastards. Probably thought the place was empty and panicked when they saw the employees. Hey, I'm not making excuses for them. I'm just saying, things would have been a lot simpler for everyone if they had just trashed the plant and left. Jensen? You're the guy that sent it. What the hell? Was your boss trying to get you killed? This was not a one-man job, buddy. Although, according to these purity first nuts, you're not really a man anymore, are you? <laughs> what do they know?
啊！Ready to leave now? Yeah, get me out of here, Malik. Your wish is my command. Climb in. 